Welcome back to the Man United fans. Now today's Manchester City versus Manchester United, and it is now your Manchester City versus Manchester United live at preview. Can Manchester United beat Manchester City? There's lots to talk about. Bruno Fernandes is almost about to sign for Manchester United. The deal has now officially been agreed. He, I'm not sure if he'll be able to be playing for the Wolves game if we can sign him today or tomorrow, but it's going to be a real, real, real interesting deal if we can go on and sign a Bruno Fernandes. We might also be going for a striker. I doubt it. I reckon we'll just be hand Bruno Fernandes. Edward Ward's house getting burgled. I mean, you know, I think everyone hates what Edward Ward at the moment, but, you know, I don't think anyone should be going on and burgling his house. Look, we are Edward Ward out. Uh, quite a lot of the majority of Manchester United fans are the out and, uh, and literally everyone's the glazed out. But look, Manchester United have to be improving. I mean, Ollie keeps on saying in his press conference, well, we've done it before. He, he said it after we lost to City. We came back from two goals down before against PSG uh, in the second leg and we won. But, uh, and it was away. But look, we're in the worst form in like the past couple of decades now, isn't it? It's the worst it's actually ever been. So, yeah, um, it, it's not good enough for Manchester United and there has to be improvements at the moment at this club. So, yeah, and I don't, I don't think anyone's happy right now at the club um, and we want to see improvements in this team. I mean, and it's just simple. Half this team that are playing aren't good enough. Oli's not good enough to be our manager. But look... Um, Rashford's picking up a load of injuries. I mean, oh, well, no, no. Oh, what I meant to say that. Um, Rashford's already picked up an injury. Um, and we've got a whole team um full of injuries uh at this moment in time, haven't we? I mean, it's just an injury prone club. It's just because the players keep playing week in week out. Uh, and it's just absolutely ridiculous. We haven't got enough players. I mean. It's got McTominay. Hopefully, he's going to be back soon. I'm not sure. I'm not sure if he's going to be back for this match, but he seems to be walking fine. But obviously, he does need to be getting and stuff. So yeah, but um, hopefully, McTominay can be making his return very soon at Manchester United. But you know, um, Harry Maguire could pick up another injury. It's just annoying that the exact same players keep on playing every game when half of them need a rest, especially going into this game when Ollie actually wants to, um, well, when we actually can actually make a comeback. But that's the thing. I mean, last time we were full of plays. The plays had motivation last time we made the comeback. But I can't see it actually happening um, going into this game, unfortunately. But it's just not good enough at Manchester United. The players are motivated and stuff. So, yeah. Anyway, I'm going to end this video here. Thanks for watching for the other Man United fans. Speak to you after the match for my match reaction. Anyway, thanks for watching.